Batesville of five, approaching top of the stretch Glenn Luster with Steve Mason, Sugar Skipper Jody Hennessy, Menji Special Wayne Mahar, CRSD with Gary McDonald. And tis the club with Owen Davies, and here they come. Clear off, Glenn Luster going to the top. Sugar Skippers racing a second. The Minji Special third, CRSD and Tizza Cloud. Out of the turn, Glenn Luster pacing out on top. He leads for two. Sugar Skippers racing a second. Minji Special has third. CRSD racing fourth, and Tizza Cloud is fifth. And they're by the eighth portal. They go on up the back stretch now, racing on to the quarter. Glenn Luster the leader a length and a half, and Sugar Skipper second. Then the Minji Special has a third. Then a CRSD and Tizza Cloud trailing fifth as they go racing out by the quarter. Glenn Luster in command. He's out by two lengths. And the opening uh, quarter, 32 and four. Around the top turn, Glenn Luster. I like for the half again. Sugar Skipper laying second. Minji Special third. CRSD and Tizza Cloud trails. And they swing through the stretch now and come driving to the half. Facing on top, it is Glenn Luster. Sugar Skipper second, Minji Special third, CRSD, and Tiz Cloud the trailer. As they go racing out by the half, and there goes Minji Special now from third, by the half and five and one. Out of the turn, on to the five eights, Glenn the Luster. Then the Minji Special and the Sugar Skipper. CRSD and Tiz Cloud, and they go to the five eights, by it now, and it's Glenn Luster. Minji Special on the outside, challenging second. And she's at the leader's wheel. Sugar Skipper has a third. CRSD out driving fourth. Tiz a Cloud is racing fifth and on the rail. As they go to the three quarters, Glenn Luster, the leader, by that marker. On top of length again by the three quarters, 37 and three. Top turn, it is Glenn Luster, Minji Special, Sugar Skipper laying third in the rail. CRSD outside is a fourth. Tiz a Cloud has fifth. And now they hit the head of the lane and they swing for home. It's Glenn Luster, the leader. Sugar Skipper is now second. Then CRST up on the outside. It is Glenn Luster, Sugar Skipper. And here they are at the line. Glenn Luster, Sugar Skipper, tied for show. CRST and Tizaclod. Minji Special fifth. Time for the mile. Two, nine, and three. Okay, Riding now, winner first race, number one, Glenn Luster. Brown horse nine by Al Patron from Glenn Bell, owned by Milton Downey of St. John, trained and driven by Steve Mason. You're winning tonight on three. Mary mm -hmm. Settle, the first race now, official Glenn Luster, your race winner. Sugar Skipper was second. Minji, special fifth. CRSD was third, and Tizza Clyde was fourth. Times a quarter, 32 and four, and a half, 105 and one. Three quarters, 137 and three. And the time for the mile, 29 and three. Your exact of one and two paid $14.70. All set, second race, eight starters, top of the stretch. Golden Fellow, Gary Vincent, Meadows Shadow, Mark Collett, John Pfeiffer, Wayne Mahar. Legitimate power of Rod Gokan, Peter Mayer, Jody Hennessy, Hasty Vic, Ron Robertson, Luck, Winston Campbell, Victorious Bill, Ivan Davies, here they come. There, off John Five for the leader, Peter Mayer up on the outside, challenging second, Meadows Shadow is at third, and on the rail going through, Golden Fall gets to third. Round the turn, John Pfeiffer in top, Golden Fall now second, Peter Mayer outside, racing a third. Meadow Shadow has a fourth. Look, is fifth up on the outside. Then Victorious Bill is on the frail. Legitimate power out and moving. Hasty Beck trails and they race to the quarter. John Pfeiffer now leads for two. Then the Golden follows second. Peter Mir hangs to third. Meadow Shadow's racing fourth. Look, outside fifth with the cover. Then Victorious Bill, legitimate power. And the Hasty Beck is the trailer. The quarter, 31 and four. Round the top turn. John Pfeiffer leads for two. Golden follows racing second. Peter Mir Park hangs at third. They swing through the stretch, and now they come racing to the half. John Pfeiffer shows the way. Golden follows second. Peter Mir hanging third. Meadow Shadow is at fourth. Look outside is fifth. Then is Victorious Bill. Legitimate power. And Hasty Pick trailing the field. 
as they face on five and a half. Five and a half and four and three. They're into the turn now and racing out of the five eights. John Pfeiffer, the leader. Golden Fellow second. Meadow Shadow racing a third. Then Peter Mayer, victorious Bill. Look, swings out three wide. Then legitimate power and hasty pick, and they're on their way to the three quarters. And the pacing on top, John Pfeiffer now but two and a half. Golden Fella is second, Meadow Shadow a third. Peter Mir between horses fourth. Look is three wide to fifth. Outside of him, extreme outside. Legitimate power driving on. Then victorious Bill Hasty pick three quarters and 38. Around the top turn, John Pfeiffer for two and a half. Golden Fella second, Meadow Shadow racing a third. They're by the seven eight four now and they swing for home. John Pfeiffer with the good lead. Then Golden Fella is the second. Meadow Shadow legitimate power. Strong on the outside. Victorious Bill on the inside. Here they are at the line. John Pfeiffer legitimate power. Then Victorious Bill and the Golden Fella. The time for the mile. Two eleven and three. Reading now the water second race number three, John Pfeiffer, Bay Pacing Horse 8, he's by Storm and Dancer, from a Hoodway Lady. Owned by John McMulkin of Fredericton, trained by Steve Mahar, Wayne Mahar driving. Second winning trip this year for John Pfeiffer this afternoon to 11 and 3. First out of the second race now, official, Golden Pella 4, Meadow Shadow 6. John Pfeiffer, your race winner. Legitimate Power, second. Peter Mir was eighth. Hasty Vic, seventh. Luck was fifth. And Victorious Bill, third. Times quarter, 31 and four. Of the half, 104 and three. Three quarters, 138. The mob to 11 and three. Daily Double, one and three, paid $9.30. Quinoa, three, four, paid $8.80. Triaxa 348 paid 9930. All set third race, field of nine, top of the stretch, win Chris Georgia, Owen Davies, Pee Wee Patty, Gary Vincent, Marilyn Breeze, Doug Falcon, Blazer Scott, Jody Hennessy, Kelly Tuck Ideal, Ross McDonald, Peter Starr, John Davidson, Fenn Tillon, Brown Robertson, Carport, T.J. Winston, Campbell, Miss Angie, Bobby, Mark Collins, here they come. Clear off, Marilyn Breeze on the inside. Laser Scott in between horses, up wide. Peter Starr in between them, Kelly Tuck, ideal. Around the turn, Laser Scott to the top on the outside. Marilyn Breeze racing a second. Win Crest George, you now third. Kelly Tuck, ideal, gets to fourth on the rail. Peter Starr going on fifth on the outside. Then P. Wee, Patty, Fenn, Dillon. Star 14, J. Miss Sanjib Bobby, that is Peter Starr. Charging up on the outside, he's now second. He's left on the leader, bidding up for the top. Neck and neck as they go by the quarter. Now Peter Starr takes the lead. Peter Starr, the quarter, 30 and 3. Laser Scott is second. Marilyn Breeze racing a third. Wincrest Georgia has fourth. Kelly Tuck Ideal has a fifth. Then it is a Fendillon, P. V. Patty, Star 14, J. Miss Angie Bobby trailing them through the stretch. They come racing to the half now. Peter Starr shows the way on top of Mike for the half. Laser Scott a second. Marilyn Breeze third. Wincrest George is fourth. Then Kelly Tuck Ideal going to the inside. Then it is a Fen Dillon, Pee Wee Patty, Tarport, TJ, Miss Angie Bobby. They were by the half and three and two. And around the turn now they drive on to the five eight. Pacing on top, Peter Starr. Laser Scott racing a second win. Crest Georgia now third. Kelly Tuck Ideal a fourth. Then uh, Fen Dillon a fifth on the outside. On to the three quarters. Peter Starr win. Crest Georgia second. Then Laser Scott up tight third. Looking for room. Try to move. Outside of him, Fen Dillon. Then it's Pee Wee Patty Marilyn Freeze. Kelly Tuck Ideal. Tarport TJ. Miss and Joe Bobby. And they're into the top turn and pacing uh, with the lead. Facing out on top, it is Wincrest Georgia, the inquiry sign going up at the uh, head of the lane. Up on the outside comes Laser Scott, bidding for the top. Laser Scott, Wincrest Georgia, Pee Wee Patty driving on the strong. And it is going to be Laser Scott and Pee Wee Patty coming on at the line. Laser Scott, Pee Wee Patty, Wincrest Georgia. 
And Kelly Tuck ideal. The time for the mile. Two ten and one. The inquiry side is up. Very subtle the third race. Now official. Wincrest Georgia third. Pee Wee Patty second. Marilyn Breeze fifth. Laser Scott. Here race winner. Kelly Tuck ideal fourth. Peter Star sixth. Ben Dillon was ninth. Tarport TJ eighth. Miss Angie Bobby seventh. Race times quarter thirty and three fifths. The half 103 and two. Three quarters 137 and two. The time for the mile to 10 and one. The exactive four and two paid $44.50. Triactive four two one paid $44.60. All set for the fourth race, field of eight, approaching top of the stretch, Miramichi Dash and John Davidson. Demand control, Gary McDonald, the verbatim Ross McDonald, De Derby's Brent Brian Moore. PHF Lovella, Doug Falcons, Columbia Luke Peter DeCarton, Flying Penn, Gary Vincent, BJ Denver with Jody Hennessy, and here they come. Clear off PHF, Luana goes to the top, demand control on the inside, racing second in between horses, verbatim his third. Round the turn on the far outside, PHF, Luana not demand control, takes command. Demand control, PHF, Luana left down him, racing on second, they're neck and neck. And that's Miramichi dash off stride, trailing his back, pacing. On off the back stretch, PHF, Luana grabs the top, demand control to second, verbatim his third. P.J. Denver's racing a fourth. Derby's Brent going up fifth on the outside. And they're by the opening quarter now in demand control. Grabs the top again. He's the later into the top turn. Demand control, P.H.F. Lovella, B.J. Denver. Out rushing on now to second. He's at the leader's wheel. P.H.F. Lovella now third. Verbatim is fourth. Derby's Brent driving fifth. Flying pin, a Columbia loop. Miramichi dash and through the stretch they come. They're racing on to the half. And pacing with the lead, B.J. Denver now. Demand control to second, P.H.F. Lovella has a third. Derby Sprint and Verbatim, uh, Columbia Luke in flying pen. Miramichi Dash trailing at the by the, quarter, by the half in five. Out of the turn now, they drive on to the uh, five-eighths, and B.J. Denver shows the way. Demand control is racing second. P.H.F. Lovella has third. Derby Sprint has gone to fourth. Verbatim's fifth in the rail. Columbia Luke flying pen. Miramichi dash swinging out three wide and rushing on. Off the back stretch out of the three quarters. B.J. Denver a length and a half. Demand control second. P.H.F. Lovella third. Miramichi dash wide. Racing now fourth. Going on. Verbatim is fifth. They were by the three quarters and 39. Head of the top turn. B.J. Denver demand control. P.H.F. Lovella. Then Verbatim comes to fourth. Miramichi Dash outside fifth. Columbia Luke. Then Flying Pen. Derby Sprint. And now they swing for home. It's B.J. Denver. Demand control to second. P.H.F. Luella on the far outside. Verbatim is coming on. It is a B.J. Denver. P.H.F. Luella. Here they are. They're tight at the line. Too tight to call. Maybe P.H.F. Luella. B.J. Denver and the Verbatim. The time for the mile. 2-12 and 1. And the photo for win number 5, PHF Louvala, Brown Mare 8, McCanny Choice from Louvala Scott. On by Thomas Grant of St. John, trained by Paul Brown, Doug Falcons driving. Also in the photo number 9, B.J. Denver, be pacing horse 5 by Lehigh Hanover from Kimmy's Whim. On by John Bailey of Fredericton, trained by John Davies, Jody Hennessy driving, and we're waiting for a photo for win. We're going to settle the fourth race now. Official Miramichi Dash was sixth. Demand Control fourth. Verbatim was third. Derby Sprint eighth. PHF Luella, your race winner. Columbia Luke was seventh. Flying Pen fifth. B.J. Denver, second, times a quarter, 32 and one. The half, 105, three quarters, 139, mile to 12 and one. Quinella, 59, paid 58.10. Exact to 59, paid 142.30.
Fifth race, five strutters approaching top of the stretch. Space side, Nancy Ivan Davies. Lady Tricia, Bill Nicholson. Spoiled sport, Jody Hennessy. Gemini Jewel, Tom Mason. Miramichi Darrell, Phil Sowers. Here they come. They're off, Gemini Jewel to the top, and Lady Tricia racing for it on the inside. Miramichi Darrell gets to a third. Base side, Nancy has fourth. Spoil Sport racing fifth around the turn. Lady Tricia's on top. Gemini Jewel takes cover behind her, racing a second. Miramichi Darrell third. Base side, Nancy fourth. And Spoil Sport trailing fifth, and they go to the quarter. Lady Tricia a length. Gemini Jewel a second. Miramichi Darrell third. Base side, Nancy's racing a fourth. And Spoil Sport trails fifth as they go racing out by the quarter. And they were by that marker, 31 and 3. Into the top turn, Lady Tricia, Gemini Jewel. Then Miramichi Darrell, base at Nancy. And a Spoil Sport trailing as they come to the 3 8 ball. By that marker now, they swing through the stretch and come racing to the half. And Lady Tricia cuts it out. She has the best of it at a length. Gemini Jewel a second, here comes Bayside Nancy rushing on from fourth. Miramichi Darrell's third though. Spoil Sport moving fifth with cover as they go racing off by the half in three and four. Out of the turn now on to the uh, five eights, Lady Tricia. Gemini Jewel. Miramichi Darrell still third, Bayside Nancy fourth. Spoil Sport fifth, they're by the five eights now and it's on to the three quarters. Lady Tricia with Gemini Jewel. Out to challenge from second. They're neck and neck and now Gemini Jewel grabs the top with Lady Tricia second. Then Bayside Nancy's third. Baramashi Darrell's fourth. Spoil Sport trailing fifth. And they are by the three quarters by that marker in 36 and 2. Out of the top turn, Gemini Jewel has moved out now by three. Lady Tricia second. Baramashi Darrell's holding third. Then Spoil Sport coming to the inside. Bayside Nancy on the outside, and they swing for home. It is Jim Jewel. Lady Trisha with Miramichi Darrell coming out again. Spoil Sport going to the inside, and here they are at the line. It is Jim Jewel tight for second. Lady Trisha, Miramichi Darrell. Then Spoil Sport and Bayside Nancy. The time for the mile 2.09. Parading now, the winner of the fifth race, number five, Gemini Jewel, brown facing mare six. She's by Widow's Judd out of Harvey's Jewel. On for the Clonmel Stables of St. John, trained by Don Galbraith, Tommy Mason driving. The mare getting her second winning trip this season in 209. Race out of the fifth race now, official. Bayside Nancy, fifth. Lady Tricia, third. Hilltop motoring scratched. Spoil Sport was fourth. Gemini Jewel, your race winner. Miramichi Darrell, second. Freddie Dream was scratched. Race times, quarter, 31 and three. The half, 103 and four. Three quarters, one, 36 and two of the time for the mile, two, nine. Exacta, five and six, paid 23.80. Triacta, five, six, two, paid 184. We're all set now for the sixth race. Six starters approaching top of the stretch. Blazing Lighting with Millet Kuglin, Mach 1, Sean Shannon. Tis a Hurricane with Philip Sowers. Traveling Lady, Jody Hennessy, S.F. Barron with Ron Robertson. Oh, my Irish with Winston Campbell, and here they come. There, off Traveling Lady goes to the top. Oh, my Irish outside racing second. S.F. Barron has third. Blazing Lightning's in on the rail at racing fourth. Mach 1 is off stride. And tis a hurricane trails. Mach 1 back pacing quickly, though. They're by the eighth, and it's out of the back stretch now. Racing for the quarter, and Automite Irish going to the top. Has the lead on the outside, now moves out of length. Traveling Ladies racing second. Blazing Lighting is a third. Then SF Baron, Mach 1. Tis a hurricane trails the field as they go racing out by the quarter four. They were by that opening quarter in 33 and 3. Old Might Irish a length and a half. Traveling Lady second but two. Blazing Lighting has a third. SF Barrett is fourth. Tis a hurricane driving up strong on the outside. Quickly comes to fourth. Mark one now trails. 
They spring off the top turn now, and here they come. Through the stretch, they're racing to the half. Oh, might I reach the leader? Tis a hurricane up strong on the outside, racing second. Traveling Lady has a third, SF Baron up fourth, and Blazing Lighting, and Mach 1 trailing, and they were by the half in 108 and 2. Round the turn now, they drive on to the uh, 5 eighths Old Amite Irish. Tis a Hurricane racing a second, Traveling Lady third, SF Baron outside fourth, Blazing Lighting is fifth, Mach 1 trails, they go to the three quarters. Old Amite Irish by a neck, tis a hurricane hanging a second. Traveling Lady moving out, racing a third. Blazing Lighting moving up on the inside, fourth. SF Baron now fifth, Mach 1. And they were by the three quarters in 42 and 1. They're into the top turn, Old Amite Irish. On the outside, Traveling Lady coming out strong. She's now the leader on the outside as they come to the 7 eighths, and now they swing for home. Pacing on top. It is Traveling Lady. Traveling Lady moving away. The Nordamite Irish Blazing Lighting coming on from a third. Mach 1 moving up on the inside. But it's going to be Traveling Lady. Here they are at the line. Traveling Lady Blazing Lighting. Nordamite Irish and Mach 1. And the time for the mile. 2.16 at 1. First out of the sixth race now, official, blazing, lighting, a second. Mach 1 was fourth. Tis a hurricane was sixth. Traveling Lady, your race winner, S.F. Barron was fifth. Ultimate Irish third. Times a quarter, 33 and three. The half, 108 and two. Three quarters, 142 and one. Time for the mile, 216 and one. Exacta, four and one, paid $21. We're all set now for the seventh race. Field of nine approaching top of the stretch. This Maldos girl with Winston Campbell, J.B. Pendle, Dr. Hugh Baird, Lewis's Pride with Ross McDonald, Sammy Seal, Gary McDonald, Boot Hill Hideaway, John Davidson, Cherry Frost, Phil Sowers, Sis B. Babe with Ivan Davies, Cablevision, Brian Moore, Arbor Coaltown, Jody Hennessy. Here they come. Clear off, Sis B. Babe grabs the top, and on the inside, J.B. Pendle in between him, Sammy Seal. Racing uh, third, Lewis's Pride his fourth, Boot Hill Hideaway fifth, Balto's Girl, Cable Vision, Cherry Frost, and Arbor Cool Town. They're by the eighth, but it's on up the back stretch now. They go racing to the quarter, and Sis B. Babe the leader, but two, J.B. Pendle is a second, Boot Hill Hideaway. Rushing up from the outside, he gets to third, is going on, Sammy Seal his fourth. Lewis's Pride and Cable Vision, and Maldo's Girl, Arbor, Cold Town, Cherry Frost. They were by the quarter, 31 and forward. Now Boot Hill Hideaway takes the top. Sis B. Babe is racing second. Out from third comes J.B. Pendle racing fourth. Sammy Seal is at fourth, and they come off the top turn. Through the stretch, they race to the half. Facing with the lead, Boot Hill Hideaway. On the outside, J.B. Pendle now second. Sis B. Babe is third. Sammy Seal outside fourth with cover. Then it's Lewis's pride. Baldo's girl, Cable Vision, Arbor, Cold Town, Cherry Frost. Five and a half and four and one. Around the turn, they go racing now to the five-eighths and Boot Hill Hideaway, the leader. Sis B. Babe and J.B. Pendle. Sammy Seal. Then on the uh, inside, Lewis's pride going out three wide. Baldo's girl. That is Cherry Frost, Arbor Cold Town, Cable Vision. They go to the three quarters. And on the outside, it's J.B. Pendle with the nose in front. And they far outside, Maldo's Girl, three wide. She grabs the top. Maldo's Girl, Boot Hill Hideaway, J.B. Pendle. Sammy Seal rushing up on the outside, going on strong from four. Sis B. Babe is now fifth in the rail. It is Maldo's Girl and Boot Hill Hideaway, J.B. Pendle. Sammy Seal, Sis B. Babe, Lewis's Pride, Cherry Frost. They swing for home, Maldo's Girl. Up on the outside, Sammy Seal is coming on, Boot Hill Hideaway. It is going to be Maldo's Girl, and here they are, and at the line, Maldo's Girl and Sammy Seal, Boot Hill Hideaway, Lewis's Pride. Time for the mile to 10 and 4.
Oh, you shot the seventh race now, official. Baldo's girl, your race winner, J.B. Pendle, fifth. Lewis's pride was fourth. Sammy Seal, second. Boot Hill Hideaway was third. Cherry Frost, sixth, placed eighth, set back for interference. Sis Beef Babe, seventh, placed sixth. Cable Vision was ninth. And Arbor Coal Town, eighth, placed seventh. Race times, quarter, 31 and four. The half, 104 and one. Three quarters, 138. Time for the mile, two, 10 and four. Your daily double, four and one, returning $23.50. Then your exacta, one and four, paid 104.10. Triactive, one, four, five, four hundred and fifty dollars and sixty cents. All set for the eighth race. Field of eight approaching, top of the stretch. Island Candy, Ross McDonald, J.G., Lonnie Stokes, Holly Vat, Peter DeCarton, Ken Cope, Ricky Armstrong, P.G., Gary McDonald, Kings Beacon, Wayne Mahar, Miramichi Leslie, Jody Hennessy, Gay Time Judge, Ivan Davies, here they come. They're off Ken Cope and Miramichi Leslie flinging for the lead. Miramichi Leslie on the outside grabs the top. Ken Cope is uh, racing a second. JG has third. Island Candy is uh, fourth. They swing around the turn and pacing out on top. It's his Miramichi Leslie. She's out for two and a half. Can you cope? Is racing a second. JG has third. Island Candy's racing fourth. Holly Bat has a fifth. Then going up on the outside gate type judge. Then it's PG. And the King's Beacon trailing the field as they cope. Racing on by the quarter. And they were by that marker in 32 and 3. Out of the top turn, it's Miramichi Leslie a length now. JG outside challenging a second. At the leader's wheel. Can you cope has a third? Island Candy now fourth. Holly Bat is out moving fifth. Then it is a Fiji Gate time a judge. King's Beacon Trails. They come racing through the stretch. On to the half and Miramichi Leslie the leader. JG at her wheel hanging second. Can you cope is third? Holly Bat outside fourth with cover. Island Candy is fifth. Then it's Fiji Gate time judge. King's Beacon Trails. The half and five and four. They swing around the turn. Now they go racing to the five-eighths and the leader, Miramichi Leslie. Can you cope is second now? J.G. hanging a third. Outside, Holly Bat is a fourth. Island Candy, fifth in the rail. Fiji's going out to challenge, then Gate Time Judge and King's Beacon trailing. On to the three-quarters, Miramichi Leslie. By a length and a half, can you cope is second? J.G. is third. Fiji moving up on the inside, outside. It is Holly Bath and Island a Candy Gate Time Judge King's Beacon. Around the top turn, Miramichi Leslie. Can you cope a second? Fiji's now with third. JG is fourth. Island Candy now fifth. Then it's Holly Bath, King's Beacon Gate Time Judge. They spring for home. Miramichi Leslie, the leader. Can you cope coming on second? Fiji is racing a third and coming on. It is Miramichi Leslie and Can You Cope? And now Can You Cope? And here they are. Can You Cope? Miramichi Leslie, Fiji, and JG. And the time for the mile 2 13 and 2. After rating now, the winner of the eighth race, number four, Can You Cope? A brown pacing horse, four years by Horton Hanover. Out of double bond. On by Morris Benson of Woodland, Maine, trained and driven by Ricky Armstrong. Can you cope's first race out of the eighth race now? Official. Island Candy, eighth. JG was fourth. Holly Bat, sixth. Can you cope your race winner? Fiji was third. King's Beacon, fifth. Miramichi Leslie, second. Gay Time Judge was seventh. Quarter 32 and 3, the half 105 and 4, three quarters 139 and 2, the mile 213 and 2. Quinella 4 and 7 paid 46.20. And the Triacta 475 paid 551.60. And we're all set down for the ninth race, field of 7 approaching the top of the stretch. There's Adiel Stephen with Elmore White. Kill Karen Claude with Wayne Sprague. 
Irish Mindy, John Davidson, Mickey Freeze with Gary Vincent, Kira's Girl and Dr. Hugh Baird, Some Quick with Ross McDonald, and Times Two with Jody Hennessy, and here they come. They're off, Curious Girl going to the top rough, up on the inside. Mickey Freeze bids for it and takes it. And then on the inside, Kill Karen Cloud moves to the top. Kill Karen Cloud, now the leader, Mickey Freeze, racing second. Now Irish Mindy to second. Mickey Freeze between horses, racing a third. Curious Girl outside is racing a fourth. Then it is Adios Stephen times two. And some quick trailing the field as they race on to the quarter. Pacing on top, Kill Karen Cloud, a length and a half. Curious Girl up on the outside, now second. Irish Mindy is a third. Mickey Freeze is a fourth. Adios Stephen times two. Some quick trails, quarter 32 and one. Around the top turn, Kill Karen Cloud now but two. Irish Mindy racing second. Mickey Freeze comes to third. Curious Girl hangs a fourth. Adios Stephen is now a fifth. That is times two, and some quick trailing, and they've worked through the stretch, come racing to the half, and Kill Karen Cloud is up by three lengths now. Irish Mindy racing second, Mickey Freeze a third, Curious Girl hangs a fourth, that is Adios Stephen, a times a two, then some quick trailing, they were by the half, and four and four around the turn, they go racing to the five-eighths. Kill Karen Cloud on top of two, Irish Mindy second, Mickey Freeze, out driving on the third, Adios Steven is fourth. Then it's Curious Girl, some quick and times two out three wide. On to the three quarters. Mickey Freeze now grabs the top, kill Karen Cloud, racing a second. Irish Mindy out to challenge now from a third going on. Times two is fourth. They race on by the three quarters. It by 139. Out of the top turn, Mickey Freeze leading now by four. Mickey Freeze and Irish Mindy, then Kill Karen Cloud and times two, then it's Curious Girl, some quick. Adios, Stephen. At the head of the lane, it's Mickey Freeze moving away. A lead of about six right now. Mickey Freeze and Irish Mindy, Kill Karen Cloud and times two is coming on. But it's going to be Mickey Freeze all alone by a dozen. And at the line, it is Mickey Freeze. Then times two gets second. Irish Mindy third and Kill Karen Cloud is fourth. And the time for the mile, 2, 12, and 2. We're waiting now, the winner of the ninth race, number 4, Mickey Freeze. A black pacing mare, 8 years, by speed ticket from Kathy Freeze. Owned by Gene O'Connor of St. John and trained by Gene O'Connor. Tommy Mason driving. The mare getting her second winning trip this season, 2, 12, and 2. Race out of the ninth race, now official, Adio Stephen, seventh. Uh, Kill Karen Cloud was fourth. Irish Mindy, third. Mickey Freeze, your race winner. Kira's Girl was sixth. Some Quick, fifth. And Times, two, was second. Race times, quarter, 32 and one. The half, 104 and four. Three quarters, 139. Time for the mile, two, 12 and two. You're exacted four and seven, paid forty two forty, and your triactive four seven three, paid seventy eight forty. And we're all set now for the tenth race. Field of eight approaching, top of the stretch, Maramashipo with Phil Sowers, Asian Senator Jody Hallisey, AC's Peter Tom Mason, Night Catcher with Ross McDonald, Denny's Nad, Gary Vincent, Glenn Gal Sterling, Leroy Vincent. Crafty star, Doug Falcons, Offshore Oil, John Davidson, here they come. Clear off Asian Senator A.C.'s Peter Denny's Nad, three of them neck and neck for the lead in between them, A.C.'s Peter shows on top. Asian Senator's on the trail, racing for it, outside Denny's Nad, he's on the uh, run. Night Catcher gets to third, Glenn Gal Sterling is now a fourth, Crafty Star is a fifth. Then it's offshore oil, Miramichi ball, and Denny's Nat off stride, and they race up the back stretch. AC's Peter pacing out on top. Glenn Gal Sterling up on the outside at the leader's wheel now, racing on second. Asian Senator has a third, Night Catcher's fourth. Then Crafty Star, offshore oil, Miramichi ball out of contention. Denny's and Nat, the quarter 32 and four. Around the top turn. 
Pacing uh, with the lead ACs, Peter Asian, Senator is second, I catch it out third. Ben Gal Sterling hangs up fourth, Crafty Star is fifth, Offshore Oil, and they come through the stretch now and on to the half and pacing on top, ACs, Peter. Asian Senator is second, Glenn Gal Sterling back to third again, behind her with cover Crafty Star, then it's Nightcatcher, Offshore Oil, Maramashi Ball, as they go racing out by the half in six and two. Out of the turn now, they drive on to the five eighths and pacing on top, ACs, Peter. Glenn Gal Sterling Park hangs second. Now Asian Senator Glenn Gal Sterling, Crafty Star, Nightcatcher, Offshore Oil, and Maramashi Ball, and they go to the three quarters. And they're batting out three wide now. It is A.C.'s Peter on in the inside. Glenn Gal Sterling between horses. Racing a second. On the far outside, Crafty Star is third. And they are still three wide. Neck and neck into the top turn. A.C.'s Peter, Crafty Star. Now Crafty Star and A.C.'s Peter. Asian Senator moves up to third. Glenn Gal Sterling starts to let go. Mike Ketcher comes on to fourth. Sterling's now fifth. That it's offshore oil, Merrimah sheep bow, and now they swing for home. Crafty Star on the outside, A.C.'s Peter on the inside, Asian Senator and a night catcher. It is Crafty Star drifting wide, A.C.'s Peter, they're neck and neck, here they are at the line. It is too tight to call, Crafty Star and A.C.'s Peter, then Asian Senator and night catcher. And the time for the mile, 2, 12 and 2. Judges have called for between number three, A.C.'s Peter, and number seven, Crafty Star, a photo for when. John with Doug Falcons driving, and also in the photo, number three, A.C.'s Peter, Bay Gelding six by A.C.'s Dandy from Happy Breeze. Owned by Alan Ross and Tom Buckley of St. John, trained by Steve Mason, and Tom Mason driving. Mile and two twelve and two, we're waiting for a photo. We saw the 10th race, now official. Miramichi Bow was 7th, Asian Senator 3rd, A.C.'s Peter was 2nd, Nightcatcher 4th, Denny's Nad was 8th, Glengal Sterling 6th, Crafty Star, your race winner, Offshore Oil was 5th, the times a quarter 32 and 4, the half 106 and 2, a three quarters one thirty nine and four, and the mile and two twelve and two. Exact is seven and three, paid three ninety five ninety. The triact is seven three two, paid three oh six sixty. And we're all set for the eleventh race. Field of head approaching top of the stretch, bull top bill with Gary McDonald, Matt's Jet Peter Chicarton, Flag Sundance Lottie Stokes. Revelry end with Ross McDonald. Hold the line, Jody Hennessy. R. East Court, Brian Moore. Passe Poil with Doug Falcons and Anne's Doll with Raoul Sonia. Here they come. They're off match jet pacing and top it from the outside. R. East Court quickly goes for it and he takes it. He's the leader into the turn. R. East Court on top. Match jet racing second. Flag Sundance is a third, Revelry N is a fourth. Hold the line fifth, then it is a pole to top bill to say goodbye the eighth pole, Anne's Doll. Up the back stretch, racing on uh, to the uh, quarter. It is Ari's Coat and Matt's Jet, then the Flag Sundance and Revelry N. Hold the line. Pole top bill, pass a pole, and Anne's Doll now trails as they go racing out by the quarter, and they were by the quarter, 32 and 3. Out of the top turn, the leader by a length is R.V.'s Colt and now strong on the outside. Rushing on, our revelry end comes to the top. They're by the 3 X. They hit through the stretch now. Come driving to the half. It is revelry end. R.E.'s Colt is racing a second. Matt's Jet is third. Hold the line outside, driving fourth. Behind him with cover, bull top bill. Flag Sundance on the inside. Pass a poil. And Dahl trails. They were by the half in 105. Out of the turn now, they race on to the uh, five eights, and the inquiry sign goes up, pacing on top. It is Revelry and hold the line. Gets to a second. Matt's jet up on the outside third. Our East Court has fourth flag. Sundance bull top bill. Passe Poil and uh, Ann's Dahl trailing on to the three quarters. 
Hold the line is now the leader. Rebel Rihanna second. Match Jet Racing third. Bull Top Bill Flag Sundance Passe Poil. Our East Colton Hands Daw. Never by the three quarters and 39. Again, the inquiry sign is up. It is hold the line on length. Then Matt's Jet Racing second. Rebel Rien has third. Bull Top Bill is fourth. Flag Sundance. Pass a poil swings wide and is closing fast. They hit the head of the lane now. They spring for home. Hold the line is pacing on top and pass a poil. On the outside comes on strong. It is hold the line. Pass a poil. Here they are at the line. It is hold the line. Then pass a poil. Looks like uh, Flag Sundance and Bull Top Bill. Time for the mile, two, twelve, and three. Every shot will be eleventh race. Now official bold to top bill was third. Match jet fifth. Flag Sundance was fourth. Revelry N sixth. Son of Dust was scratched. Hold the line, your race winner. R E's called was eighth. Pass a point was second and Ann's Dahl seventh. Race times a quarter, thirty-two and three. Half one oh five. Three quarters, one thirty-nine. The time for the mile, two, twelve, and three. Your Triactor six eight one paid forty-three forty. Your Quinella six and eight paid six dollars and forty cents. And we're all set now for the twelfth race, second leg of the Canadian Club Winterlude Classic. Field of five at the top of the stretch. La Bouvier, Steve Mason, Kiowa Alma Hurst, Jody Hennessy. Maple Grove Shadow, Winston Campbell, P.H. Allen, Ivan Davies, Stone Rig South Patron, Gary McDonald, here they come. They're off Kyla Alma Hurst now, Maple Grove Shadow on the outside, Stone Rig South Patron, three of them neck and neck into the turn, and uh, Kyla Alma Hurst on the rail, in between horses and Maple Grove Shadow. Stone Rigs, Al Patron, three wide, racing third. They're still at it, neck at neck, three of them as they go up the back stretch. The shadow goes to the top. Stone Rigs, Al Patron on the outside, racing second. Kiowa Alma Hurst has a third and he fills the hole. And the Stone Rigs, Al Patron Park. They go by the quarter in 30 and two fifths. Out of the top turn, Maple Grove Shadow. Now in behind him, Stone Rigs, Al Patron is second on the rail. Kiowa Alma Hurst has third. P.H. Allen is fourth. La Beauvier trailing fifth, and they're by the three-eighths now. Here they come through the stretch. They're driving out of the half. It is Maple Grove Shadow leading a length. Stone Riggs El Patron racing a second. Kiowa Alma Hurst has a third. P.H. Allen is fourth. La Beauvier racing fifth as they go racing by the half. By the half, 103 and 3. They're into the turn now and racing on to the 5 eighths, and it is Maple Grove, a shadow. Stone Riggs, Al Patron, is second. Kiowa Alma Hurst has a third. P.H. Allen, La Beauvier. By the 5 eighths, they're on to the three quarters now. It is Maple Grove, shadow. Then Stone Riggs, Al Patron, Kiowa Alma Hurst, P.H. Allen, La Beauvier on the run. Going to the three quarters, Maple Grove, shadow a length. Stone Riggs, Al Patron, second. Kiowa Alma Hurst racing third, and the B.H. Allen, 137 by the three quarters. Around the top turn, the shadow moves away. Out now by two and a half. Stone Riggs, Al Patron, Kiowa Alma Hurst, B.H. Allen heading home. Maple Grove, a shadow. Stone Riggs, Al Patron, Kiowa Alma Hurst, P.H. Allen is coming on, but it's going to be Maple Grove, shadow. Here they are at the line, Maple Grove, Shadow, P.H. Allen, Kiowa, Alma, Hurst, Stone Riggs, Al Patron, and La Beauvier. Time for the mile, 2.08 at 1. After rating now the winner of the 12th race, second leg of the Canadian Club of Waterloo Classic, it is number three, Maple Grove, Shadow, chestnut pacing horse for years. He's maritime bred by exemplar Shadow, from Quaker Lady. Owned by Winston Campbell, now of St. John, on the Maple Grove Farm of Murray River, Prince Edward Island, trained and driven by Winston Campbell. Once again, we're pleased to have with us in attendance this afternoon, Mr. Danny Randon, presenting the cooler, the Canadian Club cooler, to Maple Grove Shadow.
Got every shot of the trough thrice. Now, official, the Bovier fifth, Kiowa Almahurst was third. Maple Grove Shadow, your race winner. P.H. Allen was second. And Stone Riggs Al Patron, four. Race times quarter, 30 and two fifths. The half, 103 and three fifths. Three quarters, 137. Time for the mile, two, eight, and one. Exacta, three and four. Return $13.80. Huh. Orbit Express.